yummy hot dog, a juicy tangerine, and colorful foamy slime, they are all made from soap. Watch how to create unusually shaped soap in our new video. The Laboratory of Scientific Miracles is teeming with life and soap. That's because Professor Botany and a soap-making student, Miss Felicity Bubble, are hard at work to invent new soap formulas. It seems like Bubble is having some soapy trouble. Her pink soap is stretchy like slime. Mix white glue, shaving foam, liquid soap, and cosmetic coloring. Add borax. Mix stretchy soft slime. Put it into a jar. Glue on a label. Professor Botany is very surprised. This slime is really made out of soap? Let's test it out. Miss Bubble washes her hands with the slime. A perfect sudsy result. Now let's put the soap slime into the perfect container for it. Our new product is all done. Citrus fruits are an excellent source of vitamin C. Not only that, but they also inspire a new soap masterpiece from Professor Botany. Peel a tangerine. Glue it to the bottom of a small Pringles container. Add 2.5 milliliters of thickener to 3.5 ounces of liquid silicone. And pour it over the tangerine. Let it set for 8 hours. Cut open the container with the hardened silicone. Carefully remove the tangerine. Don't damage the mold. Melt some soap base. Add rubbing alcohol and white cosmetic pigment. Spray the mold with rubbing alcohol and pour the white soap inside. Spread it out in a very thin layer over the walls of the mold. Put rubbing alcohol, orange cosmetic coloring, and orange scented fragrance oil. Pour it into the mold. Let it cool and set. Remove the tangerine soap from the mold. Felicity wants a tangerine too. Great! The professor already peeled one for her. Uh, I have a problem. The segments don't want to separate. Oh, Bubble! You clearly haven't learned anything from working in a lab. This is a soaperine. We should cut it up for the sake of science. The soaperine easily slices into even layers. Has a smooth structure and smells wonderful. A great invention! Professor Botany is experimenting with the colorful qualities of soap. Let's mix all our ingredients. Add soap cubes. Oh! The chemical reaction is starting. The professor removes a block of soap that looks like colored glass. Melt some soap base in a microwave for one minute. Add rubbing alcohol and fragrance oil. And some cosmetic coloring. Spray a silicone mold with rubbing alcohol. Cover the base with soap and let it cool. Make different colors of soap bases. Cut them into small cubes. Place cubes of one color into the mold in an even layer. Spray rubbing alcohol on top and pour clear soap base over them. When the first layer sets, lay out the next two colors. Pour clear soap over them the same way and let them set. Take the soap out of the mold 
and even out the edges. What a big block of soap! Miss Bubble wants to find out what's inside as soon as possible. But Professor Botany will do that herself. Our glass soap requires extra attention. We cut off a colorful slice. Oh, it's beautiful! This soap seems like it's made out of Venetian stained glass. The professor and her student get so caught up in it that by the end, there's nothing but a tiny chunk of soap left. Oh, what a tasty egg! Felicity's getting ready to snack, but it looks like everything in a soap laboratory turns into soap. Pour water into gelatin. Mix it. Color liquid soap base with cosmetic pigments. Make white and yellow soaps. Pour the gelatin into the yellow base. Mix it thoroughly. Spray an egg-shaped mold with rubbing alcohol. Pour in the yolk. Let it set. Mix the white soap with gelatin and pour it over the yolk. Take out the soap egg once it's set. This sunny side up soap looks almost real. And now let's test its internal strength. This soap is soft like jelly and completely inedible. Miss Bubble isn't listening to the professor at all. She's listening to music. My student is so disobedient. Come on, get it together. Go fetch my ingredients. In the meantime, the professor has a soapy prank ready for her student. Form the shape of a music player out of polymer clay. Trim the corners. Attach a clip to the back and add clay buttons. Bake it in an oven according to the packaging instructions. Color the device with acrylic paint. Draw on details, icons on the screen, and the logo. Sprinkle cosmetic glitter into a melted soap base. Pour it into half of the egg-shaped mold. Put the MP3 player inside. Let it set, pour soap into the other half of the mold, and connect the egg with the set half. After all the soap has set, take the egg out of the mold. Professor Botany plugs headphones into her cute, soapy MP3 player. Her student will definitely be glad to get a gift like this. Miss Bubble sees the shiny egg with her favorite device inside. What happened? Oh no! Is the only way out to wash my MP3 player out of the egg? Professor Botany gives her a hint. You can use a knife. Go forth, Bubble. Seek your fortune in the egg. First, the student turns the soap into the scaly egg of a dragon. And then she cuts off shiny layers, one after another. There are no eggs like this in the natural world. Finally, Felicity gets to the player. Wait a minute, this is a fake. And Professor Botany had the real player this whole time. Miss Bubble brings the professor the results of all her research, but the professor doesn't like a single one of them. Then the student decides to show off her soap know-how. Check out this hot dog. It's an exact copy made out of soap. Melt some soap base. Color it with makeup pigment. Make it look like a bun. Pour it into a long oval mold sprayed down with rubbing alcohol. Let it set. Pour soap base the color of a hot dog into the next mold. And finally, pour a thin layer of light green soap base into a flat mold. Wait until the soap is set, but is still warm. Cut the soap in a thin layer. Make lettuce leaves. Attach the leaves to the bun. 
and put the sausage on top. Make red soap the same way. When the soap is set but still warm, cut a thin strip. Make it look like ketchup and put it on top of the hot dog. Professor Botany accepts the offering. Let's dissect the specimen. The soap hot dog is a wonderful color and it's easy to cut through, like a soft bun. And the tiny lettuce leaves are truly a work of soap art. Amazing job, Miss Bubble. You passed your soap exam. Did you like our soap experiments? Then let us know in the comments about what soap you're planning to cook up in your home laboratory. And don't forget to like this video, subscribe to our channel, and click on the bell so you don't miss new surreal recipes from Troom Troom.